Hey, before I start the video, man, uh, shout out to Wash on the Daily, man. Go follow them on Instagram. Uh, go follow my guys over there. They do giveaways. They have this name, that Rare Skin Series, on their Instagram story. Here with a lot of dope stuff. So please go ahead and follow them on IG at Wash on the Daily, WSH on the Daily. Shout out to those guys over there. Uh, 14,000 Instagram followers and counting. Uh, the fastest growing Instagram on the Instagram space when it comes to our watching the commanders. Take command, hit that follow button. Enjoy the video. Peace. Day, so enjoy the training camp coverage. I'll give you guys a quick recap of what I think about today at the end of all the footage and all the tweets. Sada Jack Selby and also John Kyle, they had all the videos and all of the tweets that were during practice. So enjoy the footage, be easy. Let's get these tweets, man. So Jack Selby tweeted this big hole on the right for Brian Robinson to slip through 11 on 11. Nice block for, from Cosby on uh, William Bradley King to create running room. Sam Cosby, my guy. Shout out to B Rob on that. Uh, Wentz just went seven, uh, six or six on the seven on seven drill. Saw some really nice passes to Dax Mill and a very impressive sideline catch to Terry McLaurin. I know it's a seven on seven, but he's he, he looking the best he looked all camp during the seven on seven drill, which is great. I want to see Carson Wentz be more consistent. Uh, Erickson, McGowan, and Mill were on punt returns today. Dax Mill's going to win this job, honestly speaking. I just think that he's a better receiver than the other two guys and brings more to the receiver position. Amari Rodgers was wide open, as Zach Selby's tweeting here, down the middle of the field and brought in the catch to Army, like what I'm seeing from the tight end. We got some good depth over here at tight end uh, with the commander. Shout out to Amari Rodgers looking really good today as well. Saw so William Jackson with the DBs individual and individuals but now in the full team drills. Uh, John Conn tweeted this at 9.44 a.m. Uh, no surprise here. William Jackson the third is still, you know, trying to ease himself back into things. So no surprise there. Only way for week one. Uh, Carson Wentz during his two-minute drills, four for six with a fumble, recovered by Wentz. So not lost fumble. Uh, drive in it with a nearly nice touchdown to Dax Milne. Dax Milne has been balling out, bro. Balling out of control. Shout out to Dax. Big Dax Mill guy, so I like him a lot. Oh, this has already been stated as well, so sorry about that. Yeah, they, those, are the, those are the three guys on pump returns today. I don't think McGowan making this roster new as Alex Erickson. I don't know why they're still even on the team right now, to be honest with you. Next tweet here. That's it for two-minute drills. Period ends with an interception by Reeves from Heineke. Uh, Jeremy Reeves having a really solid day, having a pick today. I think he should definitely make this roster as a depth safety. I think I like him as a backup. He's really solid. Uh... Amari Rodgers grabbed a touchdown during goal line drills. Another impressive grab for the tight end trying to earn a spot on the roster. Amari Rodgers is going crazy today. But it's not that many tight ends playing today. So, shout out to him, though. He's going crazy. Uh, Carson Wentz rolls out and gets into the end zone. Hodges had a really nice block on Foley to clear it away. Hey, okay, okay. Mr. Hodges, Curtis Hodges with the block there. And Wentz getting in the end zone. That's great. Uh, Ron Rivera just relieved Sam Mills of his duties as defensive line coach. Believing a change didn't be needed. Jeff Zoninska is filling the role. No surprises there. He had to go. So, yeah, y'all see I'm at work, so I got to keep this one kind of brief. But quick recap today. Wentz was incredible. Uh, he went four for six on one uh, one drive today. There's a goal line uh, drill. He went six for six in seven on sevens, including a touchdown pass to Dax Mion, I think. No, that was during the goal line. So he had a touchdown pass to, to to Dax Mill during the goal line uh, drills, but also he went six for six 
during the 7-on-7, seven seven, which is good. He was extremely crisp today. Uh, most crisp day he's had all camp long. Also, Warren Sapp was in the attendance. I didn't know that until uh, I watched Two Scores video, so shout out to Rico on that one. And Sam Mills got fired. <laughs> Great news, man. <laughs> the Sam Mills just wasn't the defensive line coach that we need for this team. Like He wasn't a horrible coach by any stretch. Uh, I had, a, I had a text message and one of my group chats saying he's trash. I'm not saying he's trash. That's just wrong. Uh, but he just wasn't the guy to help this defensive line take it to the next level. It, just what it, it was what it was, just being honest with you. And another thing that happened today, yeah, Wentz balled out. Dax Milne was incredible. Sam Mills got fired. And uh, the rest of the team was solid. Uh, Kelvin Harmon had a solid day, uh, not a bad day as well. And uh, – the team was overall solid today. Uh, but those two in particular, Carson Wentz and Dax Mill, were incredible. Shout out to those two. Hope you guys enjoyed this training camp recap for day 12 and all the tweets from Zach Selby as well as John Kime. Uh, like, comment, subscribe to the Protest Sports Network if you haven't done so. Join the Protectians if you've not done so. Also, if you want to become a channel member, please do so. Uh, it will definitely help the channel grow and also give you guys some exclusive perks. So please do so as well. And and put God for save this COVID. And don't catch that monkey pox, man. I'll catch you guys next video. Peace, love, and blessings to all of y'all. You guys have a wonderful day. Enjoy your Taco Tuesday. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.